Hi, Adrian here from Kingston Yacht Sales, brought to you by United City Yachts. Today I'm on a 2007 Four Winds 278 Vista. Now before we get started with the tour, I want to remind you, this is a 360 virtual video. So you don't have to look at me the whole time. If you're on your smart device, while I'm talking, you can simply scroll around using your finger, look at different parts of the boat, zoom in, zoom out. Or if you're at home on your desktop, just use your mouse, grab the screen, drag around, look at some different things as we're talking. So, 2007 Four Winds Vista 278. This is that 27, five, uh, 27 foot cruising boat. Now when you're looking at the 26 and 27 foot cruisers, what you want to look at is that cockpit layout because that really affects how things are laid out down below. There's, there's sort of two different options you can get with. You can go with the, the, what the Four Winds has done here and have the two seats at the helm side by side so the captain and the co-pilot are together. Then you get the companionway off to one side. Or, instead, you can have a lounger on this side, have a bucket seat over here, and a bit of a walkway down the center. And there's advantages and disadvantages to both. It really depends what you like when you're on the boat, what sort of catches your own eye. The, you know, some of the advantages are, with this set off to the side, you get nice, sturdy, fixed stairs that take you up and through the windshield. If you have that door in the middle, you're going to have the stairs built into the door itself because they have to, or have very small stairs to kind of sneak up the side of that door. And also, it really shows down below. When you have the door offside, like in this four winds, you have a much bigger entryway to the aft cabin. When that door is in the middle, like you might see on some sea rays in the same size range, that's when you get a smaller entry off to the side. So it's really personal preference. This 2007, uh, it's powered by Volvo, 5.7 liter, single. Uh, dual prop, so it's got the two counter spinning uh, props down the bottom. Uh, you'll notice that it does have the uh, full wraparound seating here, table which comes out. This cushion over here can actually pull out as well, so you can switch different options for tables in here if you want to buy different things. Uh, but still, you have that nice wraparound seating. We have a wet bar. Here, you'll find your cooler storage. And then up to the helm here, let me bring you up and I'll bring you down below. But I'll just show you. The real advantage to this uh, this door here is that you have this seating. This is captain and co-pilot side by side when you're going for a cruise, which is a really nice feature um, as long as everybody's getting along. Um, you do have a Raymarine chart plotter that's built in here. Uh, we do have the throttle control over here, VHF, spotlight, and then different battery parallels, your engine hatch. It is an electronic engine uh, hatch here. Courtesy lights, some nav lights, trim tabs stereo head, bilge pumps, and your windlass as well. This boat does have the electric windlass. Now what's uh, very impressive about this boat is it's only 105 hours. This boat has been very lightly used, so really we're not expecting any problems with this one at all. It's quite a lovely boat, it's in nice shape. Full camper top, lots of headroom, uh, built-in radar arch, gives it that sharp feel, you know, that nice aggressive profile. And do take a look at some of the pictures from the outside, and you'll notice that it has that beautiful black stripe that goes down the side, which gives it a very sharp look. I'm going to quickly take you down below, just to give you a bit of a sense. Uh, uh, do note, by the way, there is cockpit carpets for out there. The owner just has them at home as the boat's still in storage. But you'll notice full microwave, sink, Burner, we've got the refrigerator down here, and this is the entrance way to the full-size stand-up head Check out some of the pictures. It's not a bad size at all If you spin around behind you, you'll see what I mean about the door off to the side It gives you that large entrance to the aft cabin and up here Of course, this is a convertible table which is going to go down to make that second bed And they did a smart idea the cushions for that second bed are up here. They're stored uh, So you can actually slide them in there Notice a nice mirror, lots of room for some storage up here, lights all the way through, and some ventilation. So again, I'm Adrian from Kingston Yacht Sales, brought to you by United City Yachts. We are Canada's Yacht, Yacht Sales Network, and today I'm showcasing my 2007 Four Winds Vista 278. Thanks very much.